Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil. So, I made my way to the piano room, and I'm really hoping this Moonlight Sonata works. And it does! We did something like that in Resident Evil Zero with Billy and Rebecca. And Billy could do it better than Rebecca. Will you take the gold emblem? Yeah. <sighs> That's what I need that shield for. Huh, okay. Now I know. I know what I need that for. Perfect. Trevor's Diary. Eleven days have passed since arriving on this estate. How did I end up like this? A guy in a lab coat brought me a meager plate of food and said, Sorry to put you through this, but it's for security reasons. That's when it hit me. It all makes sense now. There are only two people that know the secret of this mansion, Sir Spencer and myself. If they kill me, Sir Spencer will be the only person that knows the secret. But for what purpose? It doesn't matter now. It's too dangerous here. My family, I hope they're all right. I've decided to escape. Jessica, Lisa, I pray you are safe. How could I be so careless? I lost my favorite lighter, the one Jessica gave me for my birthday. Now it's going to be that much harder to escape this dark place. What's the lighter we have? November 13th, the date when my fate was sealed. My aunt was hospitalized just three days before that. Jessica and Lisa said they were going to visit her. I wish I could be there with them. But wait, is it? <laughs> but wait, I had a stroke. Okay. But wait, even as I'm writing, my memory is coming back to me more vividly. Just before I passed out, I remember the men in the lab coat said something like, most likely your family is already... I pray for their safety. Somehow I managed to get out of that room, but getting out of this mansion won't be as easy. I have to get past all these the booby traps. Tiger eyes, gold emblem, I have to try and remember for my own sake. Tiger eyes, huh? That might be something to do with the blue gem we have. Uh, but this is, this is good. So I need to, uh, nope. I need to get out of here. I need to get that that gold plate, and I guess maybe the the golden one uh, goes in the dining room, and maybe that'll unlock something. So I don't need to go that way. I'm gonna go this way. And uh, on my way back here, I killed this zombie. And let's see, going upstairs would be. The best thing to do this way. I'm just gonna go this way because I'm not sure if that way it's gonna be the best. Um, I also looked up for the uh, where the other save room is, and it looks like I've already been to that save room. So maybe I should try going there. Because I looked up how to burn the zombies and how to get the kerosene, and it's in that save room, and I think it might be where I was being attacked by a bee. Because I tried to just use my lighter and it doesn't work like that, so... If I can just get to that save room, that would really be helpful. I guess I'm going to try to see if I can get to that one instead of the one I usually go to. Since I'm going to need those items anyway. And it's on the first floor. I don't know if this is going to lead to it. I think it should. 
But I really want to burn all these bodies that are lying around because I really don't want to have to deal with the Crimson Zombie when I have no more grenade launcher, which is going to happen soon. Because I, I think I only have two bullets left. That dog is easy enough to avoid, I think. I've avoided him like, I don't know, four times by now. Hold on. Nate's off the counter. No, you can't be on the counter. <sighs> okay. So. Oh, you know what? Oh, I didn't mean to do that map. Have I been through this door? I think this is the other door I tried to go through, and there was dogs and uh, another kerosene tank. Yeah, it is. I see it right there. Can I get him? It's not letting me get him. I'm totally wasting my bullets right now. Let me just see what this is. Take the chemical to use on- I'm just gonna take it since I have <sighs> space for it. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna take this. Oh, I wish I had a defense weapon. Oh, please don't tell me this is gonna kill me because I- oh. I guess because they got me from behind. Damn. Damn, I had just got to that piano room, too. <sighs> okay. That's okay, it's not the end of the world. I'm gonna go ahead and load this save, and you know what? I'll be able to get the, uh, the wooden plaque thing that I need, so it's all good. Alright, so... Let me... So I saved after... Oops! <laughs> Not what I meant. I saved after I put that death mask away. I need that. Put the ink ribbon away. And I need that... It's emblem. Did I have to put my handgun away? What is wrong with me right now? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Perfect. So we have everything we need. And I'm gonna go ahead and head back to the piano room. We'll play the sonata again, and we'll actually have what we need. Uh, can I? Let me try going this way. I don't know if I can. I don't remember if it was locked. Emblem of armor. Don't I have the armor key? Please tell me I didn't just put the key away. Hold on. <sighs> Armor key. That's what I have. That's... <laughs> Yikes. Okay. Go ahead and... Okay. Perfect. <sighs> I... I'm gonna put the slider away because I just don't like how many spaces I don't have. Like, I have literally no space. And I'm gonna try to get to that other save room anyway, so... I don't have it equipped. There we go. Okay, so... Perfect. Use the armor key. And now I just need to, uh... <gasps> What's that? Yeah. That's for my- oh, that's awesome. The defensive weapon, the stun gun. I guess it's a one-use thing. I need my lighter. It's what I just realized. Wait, where did I just come from? Did I come from here? <laughs> I don't remember. 
I think I did. Nope. Did not come from here. I will definitely take the handgun. Ammo. Excuse you. Keeper's Diary. Okay, we just unlocked a whole new area. Played poker tonight with Scott and Elias from security and Steve from research. Steve was the big winner, but I think he was cheating, scumbag. One of the higher-ups assigned me to take care of a new creature. It looks like a skinned gorilla. Feeding instructions were to give it live animals. When I threw in a pig, the creature seemed to play with it, tearing off the pig's legs and pulling out the guts before it actually started eating. At around 5 a.m., Scott woke me up. Scared the out of me, too. He was wearing a protective suit. He handed me another one and told me to put it on. Said there'd been an accident in the basement lab. I just knew something like this would happen. Those bastards in research never sleep, even on holiday. I've been wearing the damn spacesuit since yesterday. My skin's getting grimy and feels itchy all over. The goddamn dogs have been looking at me funny, so I decided not to feed them today. Screw them. Went to the infirmary because my back is all swollen and feels itchy. They put a big bandage on it and told me I didn't need to wear the suit anymore. All I want to do is sleep. Found another big blister on my foot this morning. I ended up dragging my foot all the way to the dog's pen. They were quiet all day, which is weird. Then I realized some of them had escaped. Maybe this is their way of getting back at me for not feeding them the last three days. If anybody finds out, I'll have my head handed to me. Rumors going around that a researcher who tried to escape the estate last night was shot. My entire body feels hot and itchy and I'm sweating all the time now. I scratched the swelling on my arm and a piece of rotten flesh just dropped off. What the hell's happening to me? Fever gone but itchy. Today hungry and eat doggy food. Itchy, itchy, Scott came. Ugly face, so killed him. Tasty. Itchy. Tasty. And there's a closet right behind me. Hmm. Yeah. That's what I thought. Oh, there's an item, too. Oh, there's two of them? Yes, I'm gonna take that. I'm probably gonna need it. Uh... I don't think I'm gonna need to go into that room for anything else, so I'm just gonna leave that there. It didn't seem like it had anything else. But anyway, where the heck did I come from? Over here. It's a door flew. Oh. Oh, it's literally right there. Okay. I need to get my lighter because I want to light this candle. A lot of backtracking. I'm glad that I I discovered that little area though. That's more to explore. I have so many things I need to do right now. I need to go back to the piano room. I need to find the other save room so I can get kerosene to burn bodies. I need to explore this new corridor I just found. Okay, I need I need the lighter. I guess if I'm if I don't get rid of the music sheet when I use it, then I'll just use my health and then I'll be able to switch the plaques. I just feel like I need to keep the lighter. <laughs> Not necessary, but it's so dark. Rude. Okay. Uh, what else is over here that I haven't used or seen? Or... Okay, so we just went into that room. There's two zombies in there, and I got all the stuff in there. Wait, did I? Yeah, I did, because that room is an orange. Let's see what's here. And then we can also see what's on the other side of the hall, too. Okay, there's a zombie. Okay, that's the door that was, uh, that was locked in the hallway. Wait, that hallway has the piano room, doesn't it? Right, I was taking care of that zombie. 
Okay. Okay, let's go this way. We can explore those areas later. I already have a lot that I need to do. I, I know that I... Ugh, missed. I know that I went and I killed this guy last time. Because I keep moving to get in this hallway and it's in my way. Oh! Pretty sure he gets back up, but I'll just leave him there for now till I can burn the body, I guess. Okay, perfect. We're back here. I'll go ahead and I'll play this. I'm just gonna go ahead and pick that since I know it's journal. I've already read it. Okay, perfect. I'll take that. And then I'll use this. Awesome. And then I guess the other one needs to go in the dining room. I want to go to that other save room too, but for now I'll just, for now I'll just uh, put that in the dining room since I don't want to be running around with that item and I'm right near the dining room anyway. Is the van be here? Is he still down? Okay, he's still down. Last time off camera, I just I needed to get back to the piano room so you guys didn't have to see it all the time since I kept dying. Uh, I killed him, but he got back up again and then I killed him again. So, is that what the puzzle was? Okay, it's part of the puzzle, maybe. Two are running each other through, the path to your destiny will open. It looks like you can turn the gears inside the clock. Try it? Yeah. Uh, let me, let me look at this, actually. The short sword. Okay, the short sword is to the right and the long sword is to the left. So let me go ahead and do that. Yes, so I'm gonna do the small one. I'll turn it. Huh. Hmm. That's not even turning the small one. Okay. So, wait a second. Ah. Uh, okay, so now I'll do the large one. Turn it to the right. That's not right. Uh, no. Ah, okay. The large one, I'll guess I'll try to do to the left. Large, left. And then I'm gonna need to do large and left again. Huh. Well, the red is like a shield. The long sword needs to be red and the short needs to be green. Okay. Small needs. Long needs to be red. 
and the, the large needs to be green. Okay, that was confusing because all the controls did the opposite thing. Um, but I am really happy that I solved this puzzle because I was always thinking like, am I going to be able to solve this thing? Uh, yeah, okay. Let me see. There's nothing unusual. Shield. We got the shield key. So we have the armor key and the shield key. That is so awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try to find the, uh, the east save room so that hopefully I can get the kerosene to burn the zombies. I'm pretty sure I went that way last time. Yeah. I might be better off going this way. I do want to explore that side more. It looks like there's areas I haven't been. I mean, I know there is, but I don't want to die. Oh, you know what? I did go this way last time. I thought I went the other way. I'm wrong. Oh, this is where that dog is. Oh, I hate the dog. No, no, no. Please. I don't need you moving that. Wait, why can't we move that? <laughs> Left. I want to kill this dog. <sighs> it's dead. Okay. I want to see why we can move this. I don't think it makes sense that we can move this unless there's... something. You know, that we can do with it? Maybe there's something behind it. <gasps> yes! Okay, cool. So this hallway has goodies. I can't move that. That's kind of there. But the other one, maybe I can move it. No. Okay, did I get everything? That's all I know. It's still red. What about this? Can I? Yeah, I can move this one. Oh, just a little bit, though. Maybe I need to move it the other way. Handgun ammo. That's awesome. Let's see. Oh, that was it. Okay, cool. I didn't think there would be items like that, but awesome, and I'm really glad I killed that dog. I mean, I know I said it's pretty easy to avoid, but I'm glad I did it. It wasn't too hard to kill, and um, I'm not going to go through that door again. And it was just always in my way. I'm sorry? You're kidding me. Okay, well that's ridiculous. Wow, that's a lot. That's a lot of them. Uh, hold on, have I been in here before? No. I think this is the save room? That's way too many zombies. I feel like I'm gonna probably need to get them, but... What is this? Oh, this is weird. It's weird. Okay. Uh, I need to get to the east save room. It's what I need to get to. This isn't... I don't know if I should take those when I don't have a lot of room, but you know what I will because I do need saves. I will always need saves. I'm so glad I got that dagger. Okay, so there's something that's got to be here that I'm missing because it says so. Oh, I bet, I bet that's, I bet if I, if I get that, something will block the door and then I'll need the broken shotgun to get it. 
I'm going to have to remember that. Uh, I need to get to the save room. I think it's that little gray spot. I hear people, I hear my neighbors yelling or something. Anyway, I need to remember that the shotgun's there because then I can replace it with the broken shotgun. Um, there's like a million zombies here, but I do have defensive items. Uh, they really need to be shotgun down, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. I just really want to get to that save room. I want to save. I've never been in this door. never really been over here specifically. Those are the stairs. Wait, is there's a room over here? Is this the same room? Oh my god, it is! It was right where that zombie's been. Oh, I need grenade. I can't carry- oh, there's so many goodies in here. Hold on. There's health and everything. There's gotta be a- yeah, there's a box. Oh, that's so awesome. I'm gonna take all this handgun, absolutely, and I, I'm i so glad that I, I got more grenade launcher rounds, because those are really useful for the zombies. Okay, let me see, let me combine those. Heck yeah. Okay, I'm gonna put that away. Um, I will save here. I'm gonna keep these two on me because they've just been so good to me. I don't have a lot of space left, do I? What's over here? Yes, absolutely. Oh, I have. I have so much ammo, that's awesome. Okay, I still need to remember to use it sparingly though. So this, this is what I need for the kerosene. And I can only burn two bodies with it, huh? It's good to know. That's not gonna burn a lot of bodies. That's something to really think about. So I guess I will save and put my ingredients away. And then I'll have one slot. I'm gonna need to, I guess I'll save in one. I'm gonna need to get that shotgun that I just saw. I mean, I guess I don't need it right now, but I feel like I should get it. Anyway, that's awesome. I'm going to end this playthrough part. I'm having a stroke. I'm going to end this part here. Uh, we got a lot of good stuff done. And thank you guys so much for watching me. I'll see you in the next one.